that's how I look at Life Goes On by Oliver Tree. Uh, now this song actually sounds easy, but there's a lot of thing going throughout the whole song. So we have three main parts to learn and I'm gonna break down each and every part. So let's get started. I'm gonna finish off firstly showing you with the chord shapes. We have a couple of chord shapes going on. First chord is the A minor, which is mute open, second, second, first open. G, three, two, open, 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 three. E minor, zero, two, two, zero, zero, zero. F, one, three, three, two, one, one. C, mute, three, two, open, first, open. And now let's have a look at a B minor chord. It looks like this, mute. Then you're gonna bar that whole second fret with your index. Curl that, hit that bony part of your finger, and then bring your forearms towards the guitar. Place third fret on the B string and a fourth fret on the D and G. That's a B minor. But that's not the end. We have uh, three more chords to learn, but I'm gonna come to that later on. So let's have a look at the small uh, verse riff which we have. It just repeats a couple of times. We play 10 on the B, 12 on the G, then 9 on the G, then 12 on the D, then 9 on the G, and 12 on the D, then 10 on the D. So we got Pretty easy, right? And now, what's actually going behind the riff, the chords, and the song? It starts out like this: A minor, one, two, three, four. G, two, three, four. A minor, two, three, four. F, two, three, four. Now it changes: A minor, two, three, four. C, two, three, four. G, two, three, four. G, two, three, four. So what I'm doing, I'm bringing the G major chord shape one fret down. It sounds like this so we got so you don't have to worry about anything you're just simply doing one dance on the G and then you just bring that chord shape one fret up so it's now a 4-3 open 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 4 it's from that one so one more time And now we're just gonna have a look at that part, uh, that part where it's actually hanging and uh, underneath he has a lot of uh, Oliver sitting there. Uh, that part, that on-on part where he sings. Over here the chord progression will be a C. Uh, then a C slash B, which is mute on the E, second on the A, muted D string, open G, first fret on the B, open high E string. And I'm actually using my middle finger to mute the top E as well as the D string. If you can't mute, okay, that's not a problem, but it's better to mute. So I'm starting off with the C major chord, I go for a down, up, up, and then on the C slash B I go for a down, up, up, down. So it goes like this. Got it? So we have C, up, up, down, up, up, down. Then you go to a D minor, which is a mute, mute, open, second, third, first, if I haven't showed you this chord. It's mute, mute, then open on the D, second on the G, third fret on the B, first fret on the high E string. You go for a down, up, up. And then on the G, you go for a down, up, up, down. So that part goes like this. Sorry, D minor. Now let me just give you an idea how the song actually starts off. We have this riff going on. And then we have this chord progression working. Let me have that part which I just showed you, that oh, part where it's hanging. And then we come back to this part which is that verse part, the main part of the song, of the song actually. And then again he come back to the hanging part that life goes on, like the chorus part, you can see. And then we have a sudden breakdown of the song and then it goes to the outro. Now the breakdown part, we actually strum the B minor chord once. And then we actually have this B minor chord shape, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna stretch our finger over here on the one fret of the A string. If you can do, that's well. If you can't, no problem. You can just hit one fret on the A string, the first fret. So we got, then you're gonna stretch it over here, like this. So we got, 
So you're gonna really need to bring your forearms towards the guitar to do that. Oops. And then you come to the B minor chord shape all the way down over here, which is now seven on the A, nine on the D, nine on the G, eight on the B, and seven on the high E, e minor. Strum that once. And then you're gonna bring that E minor chord shape one fret down. So it's now six, eight, eight, seven, six, uh, E flat minor. So that breakdown part actually repeats four times, and we have. And you can play an open E minor chord, which you're gonna say, but no, uh, we need this E minor. So we got. Guys, that's the whole song. I hope the video helped you out. I have covered all the songs which came out yesterday by Oliver Tree. If you haven't subscribed, you should do so. I'm gonna be very happy. Bye.